Hello, everybody, and welcome to Swice Plays Pokemon TCG Live. Pokemon TCG Live uh, is a game I'm pretty new to. I spent some time playing it with one of my friends who's really into, into Pokemon TCG, um, and he kind of showed me the ropes of everything. So I am going to try my best at it here today, and we'll see how it goes. I'm thinking... I'm thinking I'm probably going to just wait until the next season to buy the Battle Pass, first of all. That way I can, you know, start fresh, start new. Let's see what we get out of our packs here. Right on. And another pack. Ooh. Mewtwo V-Star. I don't know if that's good, but it's pretty. And Rotom V. Great. Do not know what, what in there was good and what was not, but, you know, I'll take it all. I'll take it all. Alright, so today we're going to be playing the Shadow Rider Calyrex VMAX deck. It's the only deck that I actually know how to play to any degree in this game. And you'll also probably notice throughout this video that I have no idea what my opponents are trying to do. For the most part, there's a few decks that I kind of understand the basic gist of. But uh, today is mostly a learning experience to kind of understand, you know, what's coming out next, uh, what the decks that are in the meta are, and such. Um, with this deck, we definitely want to go second. So we won the coin flip. So we will choose to go second. And that will hopefully let us, uh, uh, with Cresselia, we, which we got. Excellent. Okay, this is actually a pretty good hand. So now with Cresselia, we should be able to just straight up, uh, straight up go find our Calyrex and pump it full of energy, which is always the plan. The only thing we're really missing is some sort of switch effect, um, as well as our main Calyrex. Or rather, our Calyrex VMAX. All right, so again, I have no idea what this deck that I'm playing against is. Some kind of uh, Zykian Arceus deck. Cool. Great. Okay. Okay. So first things first, we're for sure going to be attaching this energy here. Um. We're definitely going to be go, going to find our Calyrex V. And then I think I'm actually going to Quick Ball here, discarding probably the energy to go grab a Crobat. And this will let us draw, this will let us draw, I think, three off of Dark Asset. Well, that was not helpful in the slightest, was it? Then I think I'm just gonna research. Keep digging for what I need. All right, there's a VMAX. There's an Air Balloon. That's good. Here's a Training Court, that's pretty good. So, is there anything else that I wanna go get? I've got two energy there, so what I could do here is go grab Articuno. No, wait. Go grab uh, an energy with the Fog Crystal. This is the play. This is the play right here. Go grab an energy with this. Go grab Articuno with the Quick Ball. I'm going to throw out the other Cresselia. Take Articuno. And then I'm going to play the Training Court uh, and activate it to go get an Energy. And then I can play Articuno and attach two Energy to it. And then I can use Crescent Glow. 
here to grab three energy to attach to my Calyrex. Good. That turned out to be a pretty reasonable turn, actually. We're effectively all set up for whatever's next. Right, because Calyrex does, uh, well, rather the Calyrex Max does 10 plus 30 for each Psychic Energy attached to anybody on my team. And so I can basically go grab, my goal is just to get as much energy as I can uh, and use that to simply deal a ton of damage. So a Choice Belt would be great here. That's kind of what we're looking for. Zamazenta, prevent all damage on this Pokemon by attacks from your opponent's VMAX. Well, that's bad. That's really bad. I mean, we could just hit it with Cresselia. If we can get the energy for that, which we should be able to from our discard. 270. All right. Well, I mean, that's something. The other thing we could do... Oh, wait, he he did a switcheroo. Interesting. So we're definitely going to evolve Calyrex. And then I'm going to use Calyrex's ability, Underworld Door, to put a Psychic Energy on Articuno and draw two. We'll play our other Calyrex here. We already used our Crobat, so that kind of sucks. So we're dealing 30, 60, 90, 180, 210. That's not enough. Plus 10 is two. I don't think we can get there this turn. We could, this is, but all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from your opponent's VMAX Pokemon. This is a VMAX, right? Yeah. Okay, then I'm gonna attach the air balloon here. And then I'm going to use Fog Crystal to just go grab another energy. Is that correct? Yeah, I think that's right. I think that's correct. We'll attach this energy to this Calyrex. Now the question is, do I just hit him? Well, no, I think I need to retreat. We'll send up this guy. Yeah, that seems okay. And then we are going to just swing out here for 250. Yeah, we're just barely short. And if this guy didn't have his ability, we could go ahead and boss him up and kill it. But that's okay. What does this do? 230? That's fine. That's fine. Everything's fine. So close. We're so close. Double turbo onto the Arceus. Okay. So we really just need Calyrex to survive another turn, because then we can go grab an energy from... Oh, that was actually great for us. Thank you. That was great for us. Intrepid Sword, huh? That's all he did, he didn't want to try and swing anything. Oh, we got him! Let's go! Let's go! I didn't think we were going to win that. That's all right. It looks like he didn't have enough air in his drip loon. Hmm. All right, and so the streak begins, my friends. Oh, level seven, baby, let's go. Give me them crystals. Give me them crystals. Yes, sir. 
Great. Let's keep uh, let's keep it rolling now, shall we? Good stuff. Good stuff. We'll probably play uh, three games per episode of this. Is kind of what I'm thinking. These typically go significantly faster than Magic the Gathering games, as well as it's worth noting that they're not best of three matches. We should be able to get three of these in easy in uh, you know a half hour, 45 minutes, something like that. If matchmaker works. There we go. I just ate a whole bottle of ketchup. Give me heads. Oh, baby, let's go. We're off to a good start. No, I want to go second. That's a mulligan. He also mulligan. Ooh, that's bad. That's really bad. Having Crobat out is like the worst possible beginner hand. Did he mulligan twice? Well, that's something at least. We really need a Switch and a Cresselia. I would like my one card, please. Well, there's a Cresselia Finder. But we still need the Switch, which I guess we could get from something like Professor's Research. Yeah, this is fine. Oranguru. What a goofy monkey. All right, buddy, what you got? Zaki and V, okay. And an air balloon on it. Crobat V, that really hurts. That really hurts. Attach the energy, sure, and he attaches a health item up here. Okay, okay. let's see what we draw here. Not helpful. So let's see. First, we can go Fog Crystal for Cresselia. Definitely want him. Drop it down. And then I'm going to Quick Ball away an energy. Yeah. We're going to Quick Ball away an energy to go grab a Calyrex. Okay, we're getting closer, we're getting closer. Attach the energy here to Cresselia. And then I'm gonna research, and we need a switch. Or an air balloon, that works too, that works too. Uh, I think I'm just gonna switch though. So we'll attach the choice belt to Calyrex. Do I wanna switch? I think I want an air balloon in case he just tries to bring up Probat again. Like the boss's orders. So then we can retreat for free, sending out Cresselia. No reason to evolution in sense yet. And we'll just use Crescent Glow to set up our Calyrex. Good, 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 good. All right, all right, we're in it. This is, this is the game, this is it. We're in it. Ooh, that was a scary start though, having to drop a Crobat right out of the gate. Got really lucky pulling into the air balloon as well as the switch.
Just gonna boss up. Probably Calyrex. No, Probat. Interesting. I don't see a reason for that because it has the air balloon. Unless he has a way to remove my item, which I don't know if that is a thing or not. That didn't make any sense to me. Oh, Primate with of Wisdom. What a wise Primate. Energy card. Okay, so now we can play our Evolution Incense to go grab a Calyrex VMAX. We can play it. And then I think we just straight up Air Balloon into Calyrex here. And then Marnie, most likely. We could attach an energy now, but the odds of us getting an energy are pretty good, I think. It would have been nice if that had been a professor's research. Okay, well, we didn't get the energy, but we got something. Alright, we can play our Calyrex. We can Fog Crystal here to go get an energy. Yep, say we're done. And then I'm gonna use Underworld Door to attach the energy onto my other Calyrex and draw two. We got another energy, that's pretty good. Uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and play Articuno then to attach this energy here. So now we're at least dealing a decent amount of damage. And then I could Quick Ball. Too bad we don't have Crobat V still in the deck. We could go grab it. Um, I mean, I could grab the Zacian or just kill this guy. Oh, no, I can't. I already used my supporter. Okay, well, murder it is. Give me that prize card. And energy, we take that. We definitely take that. Definitely take that. All right, what you got? This is it. Zamazenta, that hurts quite a bit, but at least we have boss's order. So we're basically just looking for ways to get new cards at this point, I think. That seems like a waste unless he has the v, uh, Crobat VMAX or another way to draw up to a certain number. Another Air Balloon, okay. A Marnie, okay. That's actually probably pretty good for us. Yeah, that's pretty good for us. There's the Crobat. I'm going to draw a couple off of that. Galarian Meow, Galarian Meow. An energy card. So that makes Zach in uh, three. Energy Pokemon fully loaded. He sends up Zach in and hits me for a bunch, right? That's okay. I think I have enough to kill him. Next turn. We'll see if there's an evolution here. 
and do a VMAX. There is not. Okay. All right, so first we're gonna use Underworld Door to continue to set up our Calyrex down here. There's an evolution of sense, that's good. Go grab her another VMAX. Evolve. Use his ability to finish setting him up. And draw two. Boss's orders. Research. How much are we dealing right now? 280, so that's plenty to kill him. But we definitely want to start setting up down here as well. All right, so options, options, options. I think I want to put my air balloon on this Calyrex. Won't let me do that for some reason. All right, well, then I'm going to stall for time here. Oh, maybe he'll only have one tool card attached. All right, we're going to fog crystal, go grab. Yes, I uh, guess Articuno, maybe, sure. Well, or do we just want an inner? Nah, we'll take Articuno. Get him out of the way. All right, so my assumption here then is I can only attach one tool card per Pokemon. So I am going to Play this Articuno. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna play this Articuno to attach another energy here. And then I think we're just gonna research. Yeah, that seems good. All right, there's a VMAX, there's a training court. That's pretty good. Leave another one in our hands. And we can drop another energy on maybe like an Articuno. It's too bad we didn't get a switch. I don't see a reason to play the Ordinary Rod here. I used that. I think I used that. Let's go ahead and dig out an energy anyway and make sure that we use this. Yeah, it looks like we did. Okay. That way we at least have the energy now. All right, well, let's kill the Zaki in here. And take a couple of prize cards. That's something, I guess. So we really need a boss's order because the Zamazenta is really scary for us. Yeah. That effectively just lets him stall. Because I don't think I can hurt it. His retreat cost is two. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what else you got. Quick ball, sure. Sure, sure. Or the cape, oh, discarding the cape of toughness. Going and grabbing something. I have two boss's orders in my discard. How many researches do I have in here? Ooh, all four, that hurts.
Okay, interesting. I'm not entirely sure why he keeps switching out that Zamasinta, because I can't hurt it. Evolution Roar, discard two. Goes and grabs. Do I have any switches in here? No, I got switches in the deck then. That's good. That's good at least. It'd be nice to switch into a fresh Calyrex. Did he not have one? Yikes, buddy. That is tough. Now you have no cards in hand. Oop. There you go. You can do something at least. An energy, huh? That could be better. Alright. Well, let's go... Ugh. I mean, let's just trigger some abilities here, shall we? Slap it on an Articuno. There's a boss's orders. So that could, that'll be enough for us to win, I think. We can hang on to it. And then I think we play for turn over to here. So I am going to switch into the Fresh Calyrex. And I'm going to draw using this Calyrex. Okay, that's something. That's something. And then we have the boss's order still up. I don't think he can kill me in one turn. So if we just kill... We just kill this Meowth, then we can pull up the Crobat V next turn with boss's orders. And that ought to win the game. Even if he does kill this, we still have our other Kaler. It's pretty much all, all you know, rigged out. All the energy that he needs. Or he just sends it out. Okay. I mean, all I have to do is kill it or this Akian and I win. Energy card for turn. There's a boss's orders. Bringing up Microbat that has an air balloon on it. Okay. Great. I mean, I go like that, right? And I just win. Right? Uh, should win the game. Cool. Alright. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Looks like you didn't have enough air in your drift loon. Ah ha ha. Yeah, I don't know why he didn't stall with those Zamazentas. Because that would have that would have been big trouble for me. Alright, let's play one more today, shall we? Okie dokie. 
Uh, let's go heads again. We're trying to go second still. Ah, oh, I knew I should have gone tails. That's all right. Gambler's fallacy at its finest. All right, give me a second. Give me a second. Nice. We got what we wanted. All right, the Eternatus deck. That's actually going to be pretty tough for us. We do have to mulligan. Eh, Articuno. That sucks. But the rest of our hand is actually reasonable enough, I think. Ooh, a shiny coffin. That's cool. Azuka Zuka Zagoon. What? Man, just ping me for one damage like that, huh? Interesting. Wow. All right. We might be in trouble depending on how this shakes out. And I might shake out with a boost shake. Okay, we got the air balloon, that's good. So now I can go fog crystal once for our, uh, for Cresillion. And we can play it. And then I can Fog Crystal again. Yep, I can Fog Crystal again for Calyrex V. To play it. I can attach the energy onto Cresselia. Attach the air balloon onto Articuno. Retreat for free. Sending up Cresselia. And then just Crescent Glow. I don't see a reason to use any of the other cards in my hand. Because this guarantees the setup of Calyrex on turn two. So that's good. Now we do need another switch or air balloon or something here. That'll be important to get. What's that? Pokemon of these cards that you can use the V-Star power on this card during your training Mr. Stick for a card. Put it into your hand, then shovel your deck. Okay, so that's just a go tutor effect. I don't know what that means during Pokemon checkout. See status effects, that's what I wanted. Put four damage counters on this Pokemon during. Ooh! Yikes. Okay, well, you know, that's something. Well, there's the V Max. So we don't even need to use the evolution sense, but I think I will just to thin out my. Ooh, we only have one left in our deck. So I don't want to do that. Okay, no energy in here, so I'm just going to research right away. Okay, that could be better. Um, 
Why can I not use this ability? Is there a reason I can't use this ability? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, huh? All right, well, let's go ahead and choice belt onto this Calyrex that we have set up. Then I can... Yeah, I don't know why I can't use this. I have it in my hand. Once during your turn, you may touch a psychic energy card from Pokemon on your bench Pokemon. Maybe they can't use it on the turn they evolve, but they can. I'm a little confused as to why I can't do that. Okay, well, in that case, let's Quick Ball discarding Cresselia or Crobat V. Well, let me have another Quick Ball, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's grab Crobat. And then I'm going to uh, attach an energy for turn. Quick Ball again, discarding the energy. Grabbing another Calyrex. Play the Calyrex, and then play the Crobat. So that'll give us a whole new hand, effectively. What? There's gotta be some can't use abilities effect. What is causing this? What is causing this? All right, well, I'm just gonna retreat. Send up this guy. Why did that not work? I'm so confused. And then I can kill him. I'm really confused as to why this is not working. We'll at least pick a prize card. Okay, we got a VMAX. I'm so confused why my abilities aren't working. I'm so confused. What is going on? What? But his work. He must have some effect that I just, just don't see. Oh. Well. That blows. Okay, we gotta research, but we're still in it, we're still in it, we're still in it. Ooh, okay. I understand now what is happening. Let's evolve. Let's research. Let's evolve again. Now I should be able to use these abilities, yes. Okay, good, 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 good. Wish I'd known that last turn, but that's okay. Throw one on there. Okay, use another ability. Throw one on there, good. Just air balloon, good. Switches, good. So now I can play the training court. Go grab an energy. Triggering this ability. Start setting up this Calyrex. All right. Then I can play an energy for turn. And I think just swing. Right? I don't see a reason not to. Great. 
Okay, that's fine. All right. 30, 60, 90, 180. So he, I think he does kill me. So this, we might lose based off of him being able to set it up. He just needs one energy. Yep, he got there. He got there. Ah, Barney's orders. Yeah, I think we lose this game. I think we lose this game. He just got so many guys out. It's all right, two out of three is not bad. Two out of three is not bad. All right, how much are we doing right now? 160. Oh boy. Okay, first things first. Trigger the abilities. Good. Trigger the abilities. All right. Now how much are we doing? 220. I mean, I could quick ball for Articuno. If I still have one in there. I don't have a way to go get an I do have a way to get another energy. That's only going to be 60 more, though. That's not enough. 90, I guess. If we... I'm going to quick ball, throwing away an evolution incense to grab an Articuno, grab the energy from my discard pile, play Articuno, attach two energy, and then Marnie. Oh, I got a fog crystal at least. But I, I, yeah, I don't think that's enough. I needed the choice band. I mean, we fog crystal, go grab an energy. We go like this. And then switch. Oh, this sucks. Sending up Cresselia. I mean, if he has a boss's orders, he just wins, right? Yeah. So if he's got a boss's order, he just wins. If not, we're still in it. Probably still going to lose, but we're still in it. What you got, big guy? What you got? Nothing? You have nothing? I don't believe that. I just don't believe that. Okay, okay, okay. So then we can attach an energy per turn. Ooh, I should have ability. That was dumb. It's alright, we can fog crystal. I have no more basic energies. Wow. Okay. This is what training court's for. We go grab an energy out of discard. Then trigger an ability. Uh, let's attach this to the other Articuno. A switch? Is a switch enough? Is a switch enough? He has no other energy set up up here? Is a switch enough? Does this draw three or two? This draws three? No way. Okay, 
Think about what you're doing. Think about what you're doing. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. No way. Did we just win this? No way. We are still one short. So he has to kill me this turn. He has to kill me this turn. All right, there's the Eternatus. Can he get two energy on it? Can he get two energy on it? That's the that's the deciding factor here. Can he do it? Up to you, buddy. Up to you. There's a coughing. I mean, he has more than enough Pokemon out to kill me. That's the thing. That's the thing here. There's one. Does he have a way to get another energy down? I do not know because I don't know anything about this game. Research, he didn't have it there. Come on. Come on, don't have it. What's that too? Nothing. Great. Come on, don't have it. Don't have it, buddy. No, he didn't have it! Do we have lethal on the board? We do. No way. No way. We had no business whatsoever winning that game. Like, zero, zero business. That's wild. Don't know what's happening right now. That's insane. We never should have won that game. But hey, I will take it. I will take it. All right, three for three, not bad. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on the next episode of Swice Plays Pokemon Trading Card Game Live.